was very, very shocked to see Vanita because, you know, she was in my season and she wasn't in the finals either. You know, though she's a very, very dramatic person, very, very full of life and one of my closest friends, you know, I was shocked that, that we see each other outside, the, you know, in the real world all the time and I didn't even have a hint that she was coming. Hey guys, welcome back again to my channel. My name is Vicky for you people that are seeing me for the very first time. And please, if you have been watching my videos without subscribing to my channel, Edjo, what have I done to you? Please hit on the subscribe button and subscribe to the channel. Turn on your bell notification so that YouTube will always inform you whenever I post a new video. You guys, I just want to get to the point because it's not going to be a very long video. So like I told you guys in my previous video, that I'll be coming back to update you guys about the diary section that actually happened earlier this evening you get so yeah the housemates not all you know but most of the housemates have gone for their diary session and then you know like normal diary session how it normally is you get big brother will ask you how you're doing like what you felt about the um head of house um who were okay this were the question that was asked in diary session people asked how you were doing how you felt or who were you surprised to see in the house and all that and all that and um how is the head of house doing? What do what do you think about the BFFs kind of that Adekule actually chose? And then how do they feel about the you know the fact that they can now discuss about nominations you get? And that was just basically what they were doing. So now I'll just mention a few people their response and just let's just keep it short and simple. You get so the first thing I want to talk about is Ike's response. You know when Ike came into the house, Ike said she was he was really really surprised to see Venita because himself and Venita they are buddies, they are friends. You get and she never mentioned and i guess in this thing they mostly sign like a secrecy kind of thing you get keep everything private you understand so him he did not tell Venita, and Venita did not tell him so both of them are for that we like that woman she can't keep secrets and i'm like you too you can't keep secrets and also during the diary section ik Ike was always also telling big brother that omo the way okay big brother was asking Ike how does, does he intend to survive in the house Ike was like he is thinking of how to bring drama and chaos to the house like Ike is planning on or trying to strategize on the content he's going to give us he's also told big brother that if they don't win their wager that he'll be the one eating everybody's food any small food you see any any food he sees in the microwave in the fridge anywhere you keep your food Ike has promised you guys that promised the house meat that he's going to be the one eating it and also he's also promising us to bring content because maybe just maybe when he gives us content we're watching the 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 the, the show if he gives us content we might as well be voting for him so yeah Ike, that is Ike's strategy and also he's very very much disgusted with the fact that everything the housemates are talking about about relationship boyfriend my boyfriend i need a i'm not in a relationship i'm in a relationship just that he is it's making him sick to his stomach Ike actually this time came back not for anything that has to do with relationship but yeah he came back to main business he came back for the money and even if he doesn't get the money he wants to stay till the end you understand so he's ready to do whatever it takes to stay to the end and then moving on is Uriel <laughs> You guys, Uriel spoke to Big Brother and um, Big Brother definitely asked Uriel who he, she nominated and Uriel said she nominated Donnie. Reason being that Donnie came to her and was like, eh, in the group or in the alliance that they are forming that someone mentioned Uriel's name. But yeah, don't worry that she's not going to, you know, nominate Uriel. And Uriel now, she said that she might look like this too, but she has sense that she was like, if you could break the code in your relationship, what, why should she trust you? And that was the more reason why she actually dom uh, nominated Donnie. Get because she came up to me and she was like she was like yeah my team my team and i your name came up and somebody said i'm not really connected with Urel, so let's nominate her but i'm not going to nominate you she, this is what she said this is how she said she said i'm not going to nominate you i'm not i really like you i follow you Urel, and i think you're amazing but Urel did nominate Donnie we when it was time for nomination yesterday, you understand? So I just feel like <laughs> Uriel just outsmarted Donnie, even though Donnie was just trying to warm up to her, trying to buy her trust. But yeah, you can't want to, you know, break someone else's trust to gain the next person's trust. You know, at the end of the day, you will always be like a suspect. So if you don't nominate me, I will tell my group, we'll go with option two. And then just don't call my name. And do you know what that showed me? It showed me a sign of insecurity. It showed me that Maybe she feels that she might be up, so she wants to f make sure I obviously don't nominate her. But I saw past that and I said to myself, I'm going to nominate you because 
the icing on the cake of today's diary session with Uriel was when Uriel confided in Big Brother that she is actually crushing on a certain housemate she is way older than you guys calm down calm down are you guessing what i'm guessing if you're not watching this this show eh? <laughs> don't worry but i feel from everything i've been watching and what we've been observing i feel like the housemate she is talking about is adekunle and some people are saying he's new but i strongly feel it is adekunle <laughs> Say it because I'm so much older than him and it shouldn't be. Uriel. I'm too old for him. Age is nothing but the no, number. No, I'm too old for him. I'm, it's like when the thought came, the brother, yeah? I was like, ah, I blind it. But then I can't help it. And who are you referring to? I can't say it. Because there was a point where she asked. Adekunle his age and Adekunle just told her that he will be 28 by sometime this year you understand and you was like oh I'm way older than you and all that and all that and then when Bibi even asked her of how she feels about the head of ours the way she yeah that he's more mature than his age blah 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 he's this the way she was describing him you know that she likes him so when that discussion of she crushing on Adekunle came up I just knew that as uh, she crushing on a certain housemate, she's older than came up. I just knew that it is a decule. So which person do you, which person do you think that she's talking about? Is she talking about new or she's talking about a decule? I am for a decule. I feel like Uriel is crushing on a decule. So if you think, if you think she's crushing on Liu, just let me know in the comment section. And then what are the last now we're talking about is the fact that um, Doni actually confided in Sissy that she literally hated her so much during her season and yeah they've been dragging doing about the comments she dropped on sissy's page or sissy's sister's page during sissy's season in the big brother ninja house you understand she was like you need to go into you need to be checked spiritually or medically there's something wrong with you and all that and all that so yeah in the show today she actually told sissy that she literally normally covers her tv whenever she sees sissy on it so that's oh my God. like i was so angry with you or your sister i'm telling you so that's basically what happened every other person in the diary section was just a regular who you nominated and why you nominated the person so i just felt like let me just bring the ones that were interesting to come and give to you guys thank you so very much guys for watching i hope you did enjoy it give it a thumbs up leave me comments in the comment section i'll definitely see you all in my next one bye guys